Hey everybody, Model Man here with another update on the paint booth. While I've been concentrating on the blower and getting all the electronics done most recently, uh, the last and final modification I need to do before I install the blower is the internal floor framing. What I had been going to do was use these one by ones on the outside to keep this guy square. However, uh, and considering the inner structure here, what's going to be going on what's going to be going on is that the fan will be installed there then I'll have these one inch by one inch frames around all four sides upon which the 24 by 36 inch filter will sit upon that'll give a full inch of floor clearance uh, rather than touching the input there directly. So there's one inch on the floor for the brace, one inch in the middle for the filter, and then one inch on top for the floorboard, the pegboard, which goes on top of there. So before I install the fan, like I said, I just got to fit these guys into place, and after that's done, I'll actually pull these off and give a much nicer and cleaner look there. And with just a few minutes later, the new internal braces are around the bottom, so I'll have to lift this up, put the filter in, set it back down again, and one inch clearance should be just about perfect enough. I am going to have to uh, create a porthole cover for this when it's not in use, because I don't want stuff randomly falling in there. It'll have to probably be, be out of styrene, I would imagine. And uh, I might even be able to put it in with one of those screws there so I can just slide it off to the side or something. I am going to have to paint red, yellow, some kind of warning around here because once this guy starts up, there's a bit of a hum at first, that disappears, mostly it's still there a little, but it's nice and quiet, step up to 428. Let me hook these up and we'll see how we're doing. Holy crap, what the hell happened? So in order to minimize the length of the duct, I am going to have to put it straight against the wall. As it happens, it's just the perfect width with the window, so I'm happy about that. It does mean that I have to pull these guys off and all of this has turned into a right major, complete and total, absolute everywhere sort of chaotic mess but I've got a fire escape right there always know where your fire escape is however as to your drill you should know where that is too but you know when you're dealing with this kind of thing oh yeah there it is underneath everything over there in the corner crap 